Hi everyone, this is Shannon Enton with 100 Routes Across America, and I had the privilege of working with Ford Motor Company and She Buys Cars to test out Ford's Third Age suit. Designed to significantly reduce mobility when worn, Ford's Third Age suit helps engineers and designers create future vehicles with the needs and limitations of the elderly in mind. Here's what happened when I suited up. She's 50 to 75, which I'm almost 50. I hope I'm not going to feel like this soon. You got to stay active. You're an active lady. Keep skiing. Is it uncomfortable? It's very uncomfortable. Can you imagine driving a car? No. And, and we only have maybe 30% of the weight packets in this. Oh, wow. there's, there's a whole pile of weights on the so table over there that I kind of left out just because it's... <laughs> she kind of went easy on you, Shannon. <laughs> I'm going easy. Okay. okay. Just this. But this oh, is okay. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, and like I said, Even with the flexion, right. I can give you a little so this can, flexion. And this can show arthritis. Okay. We're trying to um, we're trying to use these to teach new engineers and designers a bit of sensitivity around who our entire customer base is, right? To get them out of it, you know, especially when wow. engineers are new and younger, they're they're a little bit focused on their own peer group or their own their own issues, right? So we use these to, to help them remember that that we have a broad range of customers with a broad range of challenges, and and we need to design vehicles for all of that. I was outfitted with a knee brace to limit leg movement, an arm brace to simulate arthritis, a hand glove to mimic tremors, a weighted vest that forced me to hunch forward, a neck brace to limit range of motion, and cataract glasses. Phew! The first thing people usually realize in this suit is how difficult it is if you normally get in by putting your right leg in first yeah. and then sitting down, um, you've got to scoot your butt in. And this is where we pay particular attention to, to the design of the seat bolsters, the pillars, the roof line, all of those things that, that contribute to your ease of ingress and egress. See, now this feels, this feels better because the seat is very, very supportive on my back. Mm -hmm. So all the, look, for, look for lumbar supports in, in seats. And of course, with, as with anything, the more degrees of adjustability you have, the more um, the larger percentage of the population you can accommodate and can be, can be comfortable. 